Yo, what's gonna guys? I'm here right with another part of best builds in the game. In this part, I show how to be monk in the game. So follow me. Okay, everyone. We have a new weapon in this part. Its name is Dane's Footwork. If you want to speed up the attacks, it's better to play two hand with that. And this weapon is really strong. If you hold the skill, charge your hand and deal massive damage to foes. And for left hand, I choose Claw Mark Seal because we use Bestial Spell with this build. Okay, we have five spells for this build. First spell is healing spell. It's better to use before the fight because recovery is slowly your HP. Its name is Bestial Vitality. Second spell is Goreng Beast Claw. Cover 360 degree and deal damage enemies close to you. But if you charge it, goes further. Third one is Beast Claw. Put the claw in the ground and rend the land. But this magic is optional, you can use another magic. Next spell is Stone of Goreng. I think one of the best spells in the game and it's really underrated. You can throw the giant stone to foes and it's work for long range. And last spell is Bestial Sling. It's useful for foes close to you and deal very low FP but deal AOE damage. Okay, for talismans, I use Root and Winged Sword to raise his attack power with successive attacks. Next one is Shatter the Stone Talisman to raise his potency of kicking and stomping skills. Third one is Axe Talisman to raise his charge attacks. And the last one is Shard of Alexander to boost attack power of skills. Okay everyone, now time to show the armors and don't forget to subscribe and like. And if you enjoy it, please share it to your friend and don't miss my epic shorts. Anyway, the helmet is Wise Man's Mask and looks cool for monks. And for chests, we have Black Flame Monk Armor. It's really strong for physical and magical attacks. For arms, I choose Black Flame Monk Gauntlets. And for legs, use Fur Leggings. For flasks, I mix it to a status. Restore HP when you close the desk. And next stat, boost your recovery of stamina. Maybe you think I use these flasks for any build, but it's really useful in the fight. Okay, for attribute points, after increase the vigor to 50 and endurance to 52, Focus on strength, dexterity, and faith because deal high damage with those. Okay, this is it. I hope it's helpful for you and don't forget to subscribe and like. I try to find the best stats and items for monk build and thanks for watching, I love you so much, see you on next part, goodbye.